Gary, a, a tough day at the Ebb Stadium. Did the shots deserve anything from that? Um, I thought it was quite even first half. Um, obviously, we didn't uh, do enough to go on and win the game, but um, I think one or two circumstances were behind that. Would you, are you able to elaborate upon that? Not really, but I think if you were at the game, you probably understand why I'm saying that. There were a few chances in the first half. Jake Cole made, made one strong save. Was your message at the break that it's a good platform to be able to push on? Well, yeah, Cowley made a good save. We had a fantastic opportunity from a corner. You take that and the game's different. Um, yeah, look, there was, we had a good spell um, during the second half, but we come out of that uh, going to go down. So when, when you have a, a slightly better spell, you need to be taking advantage of that. But we didn't, we didn't work the keeper nowhere near enough. We worked, didn't work in full stop as a home team, and uh, that's frustrating. We spoke on Thursday about how hard to beat Harrogate are. They're now five games unbeaten. Mm. Is there a sense that they've, they've not come here for a point, clearly, but that solid defensive line, they, they came here to frustrate you? Yeah, but they got some momentum, you know, uh, from last year going into this season. Uh, they've started, the, you know, the league campaign well, um, and they're a good side. I said that to you during the course of the week. So uh, I'm taking nothing away from them with their performance because you know they've gone on and, and picked up three points. But uh, uh, all the performances today were particularly good. Fine margins decide games. It's two unfortunate mistakes this afternoon. Without those, if the ball ricochets a different way we could be talking about a, an entirely different result. Yeah, we cut their mistakes out. Simple as that, you know, and we're getting, well, we have been punished for quite some time in terms of mistakes. You've got to cut their mistakes out. Um, don't happen too often the other end. So um, we have to cut them out. For the first goal, the Harrogate manager, Simon Weaver, has, uh, has suggested that he would have expected a foul to be to be awarded in the build-up to that, to that goal. Is that do you agree? Yeah, I do, yeah. Um, they're the fine lines, the little details that uh, decisions either go your way um, or go against you. But I've seen it back a number of times uh, already, and look, it's a foul. Simple as that. You know, a number of people in the stadium saw the same challenge, if you like. But um, that changes the course of the game. Simple as that. Jake Cole gave another strong performance. He came back in in place of Will Mannion, who, who wasn't on the bench. Is that a tactical decision or has Will got a knock? No, Will's injured. Uh, picked up an injury uh, at the end of Tuesday night's game. He'll be out for a few weeks, but Coley's come in and he's done well again, Coley. So, uh, yeah, got no problem with that. Um, but, you know, little details today uh, of Costas. But also good to have George Fowler back. It, the initial prognosis on Tuesday night seemed to be that he, he would be out for slightly longer. Yeah, no, it's good to have George in there. Um, you know, he's, he's done well since he's been at the club, you know. He's had one or two in different games, but uh, he's been strong again today uh, alongside Josh. But um, again, we come away uh, losing a game to another at home, which uh, nobody's pleased about. You say it, was, it didn't test the keeper enough. Was there was there anything that you, what what did you want to see more of that that wasn't there this afternoon? Well, we're a home team and um, we got into good areas um, of the pitch in the final third. Our decision making in in the final third of the pitch wasn't good enough, um, and I can't recall their goalkeeper having to make a, a real genuine save, if I'm honest. So uh, you know we've got players capable um, of scoring goals and players capable of creating opportunities, but that hasn't happened today. Thank you, Gary. We'll see you next week. Thank you.